Hey, history nerds, welcome back. Imagine a fighter jet with no pilot inside. It flies faster than sound, hides from radar, and just shot down another jet from 40 miles away with a real missile. Not in a video game, in real life. On November 28, 2025, Turkey did something no country has ever done before. Their new drone called Kizilelma, the Red Apple, locked onto a fast-moving target jet and fired a Turkish-made missile. The missile flew straight and boom, direct hit. First time in history an unmanned jet destroyed another aircraft in the air with a long-range missile. This is not science fiction. This is happening right now. Turkey went from buying drones from other countries to building the most advanced combat drone on Earth in just a few years. Today we're telling the full story of the Red Apple, from the first dream in 2013 to the incredible missile test everyone is talking about. If you love military history and crazy technology, smash that like button and subscribe to History Nerd right now. And let's jump in. So what does Kizilelma even mean? In old Turkish stories, the Red Apple was a magical goal that warriors always chased. It was far away, almost impossible to reach, but it gave them hope and purpose. Selçuk Bayraktar is the man who started this project. He is the boss of a company called Baykar, the same company that made the famous Bayraktar TB2 drones that changed wars in many countries. Selçuk said, I had this dream for 12 years to build a jet drone that can fight like a real fighter plane but with no pilot. He wanted a drone that is super fast, almost as fast as sound, almost invisible to radar, able to take off from aircraft carriers, and smart enough to fly and fight on its own. That dream now has a name, Bayraktar Kizilelma. And the craziest part? Turkey built it almost completely by themselves. Let's go back to the beginning. The story begins in 2013. At that time, Turkey was already using the TB2 drone, the slow one with a propeller that became super famous. But Selçuk Bayraktar wanted more. He wanted a drone that flies like a fighter jet. So his team started secret drawings and plans. They called the project MIUS, which means Unmanned Combat Aircraft System. For years, it was just paper and computer designs. Then in 2021, everything changed. Turkey launched its first aircraft carrier ship called TCG Anadolu. This ship was built to carry drones, not normal planes. Suddenly, they needed a fast jet drone that could land on a ship. In July 2021, Baykar showed the world the first picture of Kizilelma. People went crazy. It looked like a mini stealth fighter. They promised it would fly almost 800 kilometers per hour, carry 1.5 tons of missiles and bombs, stay in the air for five hours, and be ready very soon. Most countries take 15 to 20 years to build something like this. Turkey said, we'll do it much faster. They started building the first real prototype right away. December 14th, 2022, a historic day. At an airbase near Istanbul, the first Kizilelma rolled out. It had the Turkish flag and the name Red Apple on the side. Engine started, it sped down the runway and lifted off. It flew for 14 minutes. Everything worked perfectly. Only six months from factory to first flight. That is lightning fast. In 2023, they did something even cooler. They made Kizilelma fly side by side with a real Turkish F-16 fighter jet. The drone and the manjet flew together in perfect formation. This showed the future. 
drones, and pilots working as a team. 2023 and 2024 were full of tests, high-speed flights, sharp turns that would make a human pilot pass out, landing and taking off from very short runways, important for ships, testing the radar and cameras. They kept making it better. They changed the engine to a more powerful Ukrainian one with afterburner. That means it can go even faster with a big flame behind it. By the end of 2024, Kiza Lelma had flown more than 100 times without any big problems. Let's talk about why Kizilelma is so special. It's almost invisible. The shape is very smooth with no sharp corners. Special materials and paint make radar waves bounce away. It looks tiny on enemy radar, like a bird, not a plane. Super smart brain. It has a Turkish radar called Murad, one of the best in the world. It can see other planes more than 100 kilometers away. It has cameras that see heat and can look in every direction at once. Lots of weapons it can carry. Four long-range air-to-air missiles inside its body, so it stays hidden. Or bombs. Or cruise missiles that fly 250 kilometers. It can fly with friends. Many Kizilelma drones can fly together and talk to each other. If one sees the enemy, all of them know instantly. Future versions will be even faster. Some will break the sound barrier, go faster than sound. It can take off and land on Turkey's aircraft carrier ship. Very few drones in the world can do that. And the price? Only about 30 to $40 million each. An American F-35 costs over 100 million. So Turkey can buy three Kizilelmas for the price of one F-35. Now the moment everyone has been waiting for. November 2025, Black Sea coast of Turkey. The test everyone was watching. First, on November 20th, they did a practice run. Kizi El Elma flew with real F-16 jets. It used its radar to lock onto an F-16 from far away and pretended to fire a missile. Everything worked perfectly. Then came November 28th, the real test. A fast target drone was launched, flying like an enemy jet. Kizzy El Elma took off. It climbed high. Its radar found the target more than 40 miles away. Then it fired a real Turkish missile called Gokdoğan. The missile left a long white trail. It flew straight to the target. Direct hit. The target drone exploded in the air. This was the first time ever that an unmanned jet shot down another aircraft with a real long-range missile. The whole world was shocked. Even big countries like America, China, and Russia have not done this yet. Turkey just jumped to the front of drone technology. So what happens next? 2026. The first Kizilelma drones will join the Turkish Air Force. They will fly together with Turkey's new manned stealth fighter called KAAN. Soon, they will take off from the aircraft carrier TCG Anadolu. 50 drones ready to launch in minutes. Many countries already want to buy it. Turkey went from buying drones 15 years ago to building the best combat drone in the world today. This is one of the biggest military history stories of our time. The Red Apple was once just a dream. Now it's real, and it's changing everything. History nerds, what do you think? Will drones replace human pilots one day? Drop your thoughts in the comments. If you love this video, please hit that like button, subscribe to History Nerd, and tap the bell so you never miss a story. 
This is History Nerd signing out.